It's really making me want to vomit. Hi friends, and welcome to Vlogmas Day 13. <laughs> yes, I am still wearing my PJs from yesterday, so please don't judge. Um, but I am thinking about making more coffee. <laughs> I made this iced coffee this morning and even Cody was like, that smells so good and he doesn't even like coffee. Uh, so I'm gonna make it again. <laughs> For you so this is what I did this morning first I like to take this right here uh, I get this at Kroger it's an Italian instant espresso I absolutely love her because one I, she tastes so good and then she's also like super easy because she's like an instant but um, it says to do like one teaspoon for like one like what is this like six ounces yeah six fluid ounces of hot water one teaspoon but I normally do a little extra. One, because I used to work at McDonald's and their, their iced coffee, they just like doubled the coffee like amount to the like water. <laughs> and then they just like put it in ice. So that's what I've been doing. It says do one teaspoon. Normally for like a hot cup, I take my little baby spoon and I fill her up. But since it's iced, I'm going to do three of these. One, because it has to be extra strong because it's iced coffee. Two, because I, it's going to be very hot and I have to pour it over ice. And if you don't put enough coffee, then the coffee is like very, very watered down. So that's what we're doing here. So I put it in my cup here. I will say I'm a little concerned because she was already cold from the uh, iced coffee I just had in her. So I don't know if the hot water is going to make her upset. Okay, I just ran the outside of her over hot water so she's not like super shocked with this guy. So I should do a small cut. I wish I would like stop. Shut up. Shh. Oh my god, could you freaking not? Shut your mouth. But anyway, I do a small cup of coffee in that. And then I'm gonna take this stuff and pour a bunch of it in my coffee. Probably the rest of this because it's almost empty. Now we pour this in here. This smell, this stuff smells like toasted marshmallow. Yeah, there's just like a little bit left in that. So I might as well use her up. Okay. I I threw this piece of ice in here, but it was on the floor. Oops. <laughs> okay, and then we take our reusable straws, save the turtles, and stick her in. Oh my goodness! And then I, I forgot to show, but I have my friend's cup that my mom got me a while ago. So cute. Oh my gosh. It tastes so good. But just to let you know, this is very yummy and very tasty. And I will say, I feel like it's not that hard to make iced coffee and I feel like sometimes when you go on like TikTok and stuff and they have like the big fancy espresso machines and you know frothers and stuff it doesn't have to be um all that if all you have is a little bit of coffee and some creamer this is what you do <laughs> now that we have made our coffee our second one <laughs> we oh, oh, I'm tripping over shoes I'm the worst at putting my stuff away. I thought about doing another cleaning video today, but I was like, mm, they're probably tired of that. Ah, let there be light. Okay, makeup time. So, Cody and I are going to P.F. Chang's this evening. I don't think we're going in. Uh, I think we're just, we're probably just gonna bring it. I don't know. I'll have to ask it. Um, I don't know. I don't know if we'll go in or if we're just gonna do like a takeout order um, but either way I wanted to do my makeup a little bit I literally I have so much just like trash just junk everywhere all the time it feels that's what just to let you all know the once um, that week after like vlogmas after Christmas 
is over. I am taking off that week. Um, I have decided I, there's been, I thought about taking a break after I did 31 days of Halloween and I was like, no, that's okay. I don't need a break. Um, because I love making videos. I really do. But I do, uh, I feel that I just need a break. So I'm going to give myself that week after Vlogmas to just take a break, recollect. I'm also wanting to do a few things like around the house um, and just like kind of go into the new year with like this readiness and just cleanliness and organizedness and if that's even a word, I don't even know, um, and just conquer 2022. So I will be taking a break. And hopefully when I come back <laughs> from my break, you'll see that the house is spotless, <laughs> immaculate, no trash anywhere, no disorganization anywhere. I don't know. That's probably not really going to happen, but that's the goal. But I will show you because I actually had this stuff sitting out here. Um, I've got this stuff the other day. Um, I went to Burke's again. <laughs> and it's an issue. I got these cute earrings. Look how cute. Little focus. It's like a little Saturn and a moon. So cute. Maybe we'll wear that tonight. Some kind of outfit. And then I got this bracelet set. Here, let me put them on so you can like get the full effect. Okay, so this is the set. Okay. <laughs> this is the set that I have. So it came with this gold chain and then this little bracelet with the evil eye on it. And then this one with like the all seeing eye. That one's so pretty. I'm obsessed with her. And then I also got this one uh, that came in it. And I think it's probably supposed to like represent the chakras. I'm not really sure just because it has the evil eye and the all seeing eye. That's just what I'm assuming. So either chakras or LGBTQ, either way, I'm in support. <laughs> so I thought that little bracelet set was so cute. I love, love, love them. And then I also got, you all are going to laugh. I got this little hat when I was there. Um, and it was in the children's section. <laughs> but I really wanted it. And it does fit. I have to take out my, ow. I have to take this out in order to put it on. But it says mini influencer. What is that? Ew. Boop. It says mini influencer. Isn't that so funny? <laughs> well, one, okay, like I said, it was in the kids section, so it's supposed to be like mini influencer, like little kid, like mini. But I thought it was funny because I'm a very mini microscopic influencer wannabe, so I just thought it was really funny, and I thought maybe I could wear it for like an Instagram post or something. I don't, I hardly post on Instagram, so why I thought that, I don't know. <laughs> I, I, well, no, I'll tell you why I thought that is because in 2022, we are going to just be a whole different person. We're going to be posting. We're going to be sharing. We're going to be creating content and just be on every platform. I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. Anyway, I got this for Instagram photos maybe because I just thought it was very funny because I'm a microscopic influencer. <laughs> My, uh, I see the term micro celeb, which I think is so funny. I'm not a micro celeb in the slightest because I'm not even a celeb at all. Uh, but mini influencer, maybe mini micro influencer, possibly. <laughs> all right. So I had to, uh, wash my face and wet my beauty blender. I haven't done my makeup since I got my hair done. <gasps> I guess it probably is a sign that I like it because sometimes whenever I did my hair, uh, especially doing it myself, I would like put makeup on and be like, do I like it or what? But I guess since this time I didn't do that, maybe it's a sign that I really enjoy my hair or really like it. I don't really know. <laughs> so I've done my makeup on here a million times. So if it like skips forward and ahead like a bunch, just, you know, ignore that because <laughs> honestly I'm not gonna put you all through like an hour of me just sitting here doing my makeup because I take so long and you just like either being silent or just talking about stuff that literally nobody cares about so all right so I did my hair and makeup and we're about to go to PF Chang's this is the fit I have settled on Cody is trying to figure out his fit also, look how cute. Okay, so this is I Want to Believe and has the UFO on it. And then I got my little, like, space uh, earrings on with the moon. That one's, like, kind of red because I think I accidentally, like, squished her a little too hard. <laughs> 
And then I did my hair like this, but I have the big clip in. Hang on. And I think I'm gonna change it for a small clip. There we go. I think I think I like that better. You wanna show them your fit? <laughs> okay, off to PF Tings. We just got back from P.F. Chang's. Here's the proof. We have way too much left over. Yeah. The place gives you a lot of food. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wait. Well, actually, I, I showed it to you on the montage, but my piece of cake, I only ate like a fourth of it. <laughs> okay, but now I thought it would be fun to taste test eggnog. I've never had it. Cody's never had it. We'll see what we think about it. I don't like eggs. Is that actually an eggnog? I don't I don't even know what eggnog's made out of. I think it is actually made out of eggs. Milk, cream, high fructose corn. You can't read. Yeah, <laughs> egg yolks. Syrup and egg yolks. I Syrup! Just, I feel like this is gonna make me vomit. It's this, gonna be thick. This is she what I got th from Kroger. In Southern Comfort. <laughs> Please sponsor us. I'm so full from P.F. Chang. This is... Yeah, this is gonna be like... You should have that music where it's like do, 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 do. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, it's thick. That's what I figured. That's what I've seen. See, it looks like it's got a little bit of some, some on the top too. Yeah. Oh no. What's wrong? Shake well. What do we do? <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> That's gonna guys. get everywhere. Is it looking different? No. That looked like a chunk. <laughs> no, it didn't. Yeah, it did. That looked like literally a chunk. When did it go bad? What did it Oh my gosh, it's so thick. I'm gonna vomit. That's what she said. Here, you wanna taste it? Yeah, I think they sprinkle like nutmeg on it. All right. Here, let me sprinkle Cut to nutmeg. me vomiting. No, no, no. Let me sprinkle nutmeg on it. No, you're gonna do way too much. No. Are we kidding. sure it's nutmeg though? I'm pretty confident it's nutmeg. I just want to get the full effect. You want more? Mm -mm. People in the comments are probably going to be like, it's cinnamon, you idiot! <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty confident it's nutmeg that they put on the top though. <gasps> it's all in your mustache? It's not bad. I don't know about the nutmeg, but it's not bad. It's actually really sweet. Kind of reminds me of sweet cream. I don't know why, but I feel like it tastes like bubble gum. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm just getting bubble gum flavor. Do you think it tastes like bubble gum? I see where you're getting at. Yeah. That's uh. I don't, not bad. I don't think I like it. I mean, I think it's okay, but it's not something that I'm like gonna continue. I think to get. if it was like Christmas Day or something, I may drink that. I'm not gonna like <laughs> garnish with a cinnamon stick. <laughs> no. <laughs> so it is cinnamon that they put on the top. I could have swore it was nutmeg. Let's put some cinnamon. Wait a second. What? Mix one quart eggnog with one cup Southern Comfort. Oh. Wait. What? Wait, do we not? What? Is that like eggnog concentrate? <laughs> no, there's no way. It literally says eggnog on it. Yeah, it literally says traditional eggnog. Why does it say that? What's that Wait, mean? Is Southern Comfort some, is Southern Comfort like an alcohol? Oh, maybe it is, because this is non-alcoholic. Yeah, because I think eggnog can be alcoholic. Yeah, but so what does Southern Comfort make that's alcoholic? I don't know, whatever alcohol is supposed to be in eggnog, There's I guess. still probably is cinnamon on top. The worst taste. No, ever. that's too much. No. No, it's not. Shut up. Oh god. <laughs> that's too much. That's too much. That is no. not. Look, look, it looks just like the picture. 
That is a lie. I can't really no, show you, without pouring okay, it. Okay, well look, look. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. I don't like it. I don't like it. <laughs> I like it, but not a lot. I don't like how thick it is, and it tastes like bubble gum to me. There it is, bubble gum milk. Bubble gum cream. I get like sweet cream vibes. It's. A, I mean, I'm not gonna drink Scale the rest of it. Scale one to ten. Probably like a five. Four or five. I'm gonna give it a two. Oh, you're like that low, huh? It tastes like bubble gum. What's wrong with bubble gum? It's really making me want to vomit, just thinking about it. Anyway. They won't know, but we know. Let me know if you have had eggnog before and if you enjoy it. Um, but I think that's it for Vlogmas Day. Actually, don't 13. let us know. Don't let us know in the comments, okay? We don't want to know. I'm kidding. We let do want to know. know. <laughs> I'll, let me know if we also drank this completely wrong, too, or ruined it. <laughs> or if you also think it tastes like bubble gum, because I do. Well, I'm sure there's going to be one comment. It's better with alcohol. <laughs> Probably. We're not much alcohol drinkers, but... Yeah, the only the only way I would drink eggnog, I think, is if I was in the Christmas spirit. And I don't feel very Christmassy this year. This whole thing is a quart, and it says to mix one quart eggnog with one cup Southern Comfort. So I'm assuming well, that Christ. this whole thing gets put into one cup of alcohol. You know what I mean? Two well, shots. That'll be it vodka. for today's Blogmas Day 13. I hope you all enjoyed. Um, and thank you so much for watching. I love you all so very much. I'm so proud of who you are as a person, what you do every day. And I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye, everyone.